almost My greatest achievement ever so yeah. far would have to be the fact that... I was pretty anxious about falling out of touch with my friends. Yeah, yeah you can fall uh, as soon as possible. Of course. Trying to fit in with the community. I was most worried that I wasn't going to be able to make friends. Not being able to go to all the events. Do I need to go do something else? Like, am I am I having enough fun? I was worried about being alone because I did not know a single other soul there. I was always worried about not having a friend at an event. The sheer mass like of people that will be here and whether or not I would get uh, overwhelmed with all the stuff that's going on. I remember coming in for the first day, seeing the huge crowd, and that just got me very nervous. Uh, the first day, I walked in, people were screaming and ran out and pushed me out of the way. So I didn't go the rest of the week, so I didn't go to my orientation. Whether or not I was going to be able to balance everything. The whole big city lights thing really freaked me out. Falling out of touch with my friends in school because I'd grown up with them. Being here is a lot different than being in high school and I really didn't know how I, how I would cope to the transition. Did I actually make the right decision to come to Ryerson? Because of course we come to Ryerson with this idea of yes, this is what I want to do, but you're not sure if you can actually do it. Learning to be comfortable. Trying to get used to the study habits that you have from high school. Trying to navigate a new city and a new environment on my own was pretty difficult. And especially Kerr Hall, because that place is just a maze. It was leaving my support system. I moved from a small town and moved here to Toronto, and I didn't know a single soul in Canada. Me being like a really anxious person, I felt like I had no one to turn to when I would have a freak out. It's kind of saying goodbye to my friends. Um, I have a really close relationship with a lot of people back from high school and we saw each other every day, we did everything together. But coming to school, we really had to learn how to like, keep a strong friendship but be further apart. I think I don't communicate at all. I am just gonna be quiet until everything passes, then I react. I'm not very good at it. <laughs> I start to talk way too much. I close myself away from everyone. Really mad, I'll probably start ranting to anyone and everyone, um, but I can get pretty introverted, so I'll just take the time to process on my own. I don't really get anxious or nervous. I'm anxious, nervous, and scared almost all the time. <laughs> I don't have an outlet for it, so just kind of bottle it all inside. I'm like a super happy people person, and I don't want to put that burden on anyone else. I got you. Don't worry.